a student has to answer 10 questions choosing at least 4 from each of the parts A and B. If there are 6 questions in part A and 7 in part B, then the number of ways can the student choose 10 questions. So here in 2 parts, part A and part B, so total there are 6 questions in part A and 7 questions in part B and a student has to answer total 10 questions total questions to attempt is 10 so at least 4 from each of the parts so 4 questions if we select from the part A then from part B he has to select 6 questions to get total 10 then if he choose 5 questions from part A then he has to choose 5 questions from part B so that he will get 10 questions and 6 questions in part A then we he has to select 4 questions from part B so that 10 questions in total that's all only these are the 3 possibilities so we can write the number of combinations the number of selections we can write number of selections a student can make to attempt his paper is from the among the six questions four he can select that is 64 and then from the seven questions he has to select six questions that is 7c6 or you can go with among six questions five questions 6c5 and then among seven questions five questions 7c5 or then among six questions six questions and then among the seven questions four questions so that we can write by simplifying 6c4 into 7c6 that is 6 factorial upon 2 factorial into 4 to 4 factorial into 7 factorial in upon 7 minus 6 1 factorial into 6 factorial plus 6 c5 is nothing but 6 factorial upon 6 minus 5 1 factorial into 5 factorial into 7 factorial upon 7 minus 5 2 factorial into 5 factorial plus again 6 c6 is 1 into 7 c4 is 7 factorial upon 7 minus 4 is 3 factorial into 4 factorial so on cancellation and simplifying so we can add 7 factorial as 7 into 6 into 5 into 4 factorial upon 4 factorial into 2 plus 6 factorial we can add 6 into 5 factorial and again 7 factorial we can add 7 into 6 into 5 factorial upon so here 1 factorial is 1 into 5 factorial into 2 into 5 factorial so that we can cancel this 5 factorial 5 factorial and here 4 factorial gets cancelled and then here again 7 factorial we can add 7 into 6 into 5 into 4 factorial upon 4 factorial and again 3 factorial is 6 so we can cancel this 6 and here 7 into 6 into 5 and again divided with 2 so that is 3 times and so we have 7 into 3 into 5 that 7 3 is a 21 21 5 is a 105 plus and again here 7 into 6 6 into 7 into 6 into upon 2 that's a 3 7 3 is a 21 21 6 are 126 and again here 4 factorial gets cancelled 7 5 is a 35 so that the total sum will be 105 plus 35 is 140 140 plus 126 is 266